Hello guys, so I'm back for another Barbie doll review, and today I have 1997 Holiday Treats Barbie. So this doll I found at the Goodwill ages ago, and uh, she was in pretty, I mean her hair and everything was in pretty bad shape because the matting and everything, but all in all she was, so had her original outfit and her ring and her earrings and everything. The shoes, on the other hand, were borrowed from another 90s Barbie doll, but she originally came with these pumps. But yes, <clears throat> so I will go over her face. Now there, notes there is a blonde variant of this doll. So they had, they might have had an African American version as well. But she has just the classic 90s Barbie head mold. Well, it's not the head mold. It's the 90s Barbie face paint, facial screening. She has the superstar head mold from the 70s. Her eyes are green, two different shades of green in there. And then she has these red lips, which they're showing up a lot darker sort of red on camera, but they're actually like a very like vibrant crimson red. She has some blush. She has, like a lot of 90s Barbies actually came with the blue, the really midnight dark blue mascara. And she's got like brick red sort of eyeshadow on. She's got some pearl earrings. And <clears throat> One thing that is interesting about this doll, I have noticed that it's on a lot of other Mattel dolls where, like, they'll have a collar or some sort of something up here, some sort of um, accent or whatever, and they'll turn it inside out. The factory will get it wrong, so you have this material on this side. But why would they put something, like, see how fuzzy that is? There's, like, this fuzzy felt material or flocked material on the underneath part so I don't understand the point of putting a uh, a detail like that underneath there so I'm guessing this is supposed to be on this side but they the factory probably got it wrong and flipped it over but something I thought I'd point out I also have a spot scene Barbie that has the same thing this material is on this side, but on the underside there is like a leathery material, and it's white. So, <clears throat> and also uh, there's a Halloween doll that I have where they printed stars on um, a piece of mesh that went around. It was like a black piece of black mesh that went around. And uh, they printed s pink stars, and they turned over the material, and... Um, it didn't, it looked like the stars were faded or something, so. <clears throat> I've gotten several dolls that are like that. <clears throat> but she's got on this red dress. And then she has her little apron on with, the only thing I don't like is these are cardboard thingies right here. And they are ripping, as you can tell. And she's got a little gingerbread man gingerbread cookie on her on her on the top of her apron the apron is not removable it is goes completely around but you can like pull this back and see the other part of the dress she's got these like frilly sleeves at the top very 90s she has a pearl ring to match her pearl earrings and uh, she has bend and snap knees which they don't really bend that well anymore so the thing that annoyed me about the bend and snap knees is that I think this one bends nicely yeah that one actually holds a pose the other one does not and of course I always like to point this out because it's a nostalgic quality of the 90s dolls for me she has ta-da the Barbie B underwears. I always loved these. I always thought that was unique 
because in the 90s you never you would um, get a Barbie and you never knew what you were going to get with this. You could get a Barbie with flesh tone, B underwears, or sometimes they would have pink ones. Sometimes they would have um, silver. Sometimes they had silver ones. And then, of course, the classic white. There's also some cases where, like, I remember there was a Mattel Esmeralda doll where, uh, you know, it's basically a Disney princess head on a, what Mattel did was a Disney princess head on a Barbie body. So it was actually an Esmeralda doll that had red panties. And then there was another holiday Barbie that had, like, a dark magenta colored um, underwear. So it was, you didn't really, you really just didn't know what you were getting with those. So I thought that was kind of fun to get those. <clears throat> and then, of course, the pumps. Yeah, I'm just a Barbie nerd like that. I, like, pay attention to all those little details. And, of course, her hair is this lovely dark brown. She used... I, I will note, she came with a red hairbrush, which I don't have, of course, since I found her at the Goodwill. And she came with a green headband, which is why her hair is not parted anywhere. So... And then she has the bent arms. And, of course, the classic 90s... 80s, 70s, 60s, probably twist and turn waist. So, yeah. That is Holiday Treats Barbie from 1997. A 19-year-old Barbie here. So, yes, she is quite old, but she looks like she just popped out of the box, though. It's amazing. But anyhow, that is my little review, and thank you guys for watching and more videos to come.